Well, hello there, you wonderful humans, and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. Hope everybody's having a fantastic day. I've just been hanging out in the room of requirements here for a little bit, uh, trying to get some stuff grown. We gotta, we gotta start making some money and buy other types of seeds and things. Uh, but I've been kind of just messing around with everything in the room of requirements and making it feel a little bit more. I wanted to make this like a green room or a green. Basically where I grow all my plants. So I've been working at kind of changing the walls and and all of that stuff here. And it's looking really nice. It's starting to look really, really good. So I've got all of my my botany tables in here. And I've just been growing Dittany for health potions and things like that, because apparently I'm terrible and I just don't know why. Uh, but I'm gonna have to get other things as well. But I hope everybody's having a great day. Adjust the volume here a little bit. We're gonna make some potions. I think I can only make three more of these, but I've got tables all over the place now. Like I needed another reason to buy the game. Oh lord. I'm up to seven health potions already. I want to make the uh, the lucky potion here in a little bit too. I just have to find the stuff for that. Uh, farm those up. Aaron Meek, how are you doing? What it do, what it do. Um, but we're going to continue with the story. If we get far enough, um, there's something that we're going to do tonight. Uh, if I can, if I can get to it. Whoops, that's not the right button. Uh, this one. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, the green. All of it. Give me it all. Gluten-free savior. Thank you for the two months. And Kai, don't forget to hydrate. Swish and flick that like button. Oh, something like that. Something like that. All right, we'll do this last one. And then we'll continue on. Ooh, that one looks nice. Look at that. That's pretty. I guess you can do the whole wall at once. Interesting. Very interesting. There's so much little customization things that you can do. Emery, em, blah, yeah, Emery, thank you for becoming a majestic bean. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, so those potions should be done. Dark Hufflepuff journey continues. Indeed, it does. The road to Dark Hufflepuffdom. This is uh, 10 potions. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Okay. Let's see, we got quests that we need to do. I think we should do the map chamber for first. We need to report to Professor Fig. I do believe that there is a um, one right here, Professor Fig's classroom. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Although I don't think that's where Professor Fig is right now. A dark Hufflepuff, yes. This is precisely what we are today. The darkest of puffs. The most evil Hufflepuff that has ever ruled the land. I was hoping to see you. Yes, you were. I bet you You're freaking back. were. Finally. Minister Spavin talks more than he listens. Ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which... Listen, Professor. Oh my god, Lena. So much happened while you were away. Eldritch Diggory's portrait in the common room told me about his great niece, Helen. His great niece? Yes, she used to be an aura. Well, she took me to Azkaban to meet Anne Thisbe. You went to Azkaban? Quite an experience. But you see, Anne knew Richard Jackdaw before he died, so I had to find his ghost. Who on earth is Richard Jackdaw? He was a student here long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. Hmm... I wonder the if the Professor Chamber, Fig will end up being evil. And a portrait of Percival Rackham awaits us there. Professor Rackham. I look forward to meeting him. How did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book? Evidently, Peeves stole them. And Jackdaw stole them from him. Oh, Peeves. Oh, Peeves. Just wreaking havoc. To 
think it was beneath us all this time. All this time, like you've been searching for this longer than we thought you were. Well, well, well. I'm not saying he's evil, but I think he's going to end up being evil. If only you were here to see this. Well, hello, big man. He doesn't look none too pleased hello, either. Hello, Professor Rackham. We've placed the book on the pedestal, as you asked. And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. How do you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend, see now why you needed to return with the book? I do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. That you have come this far tells me that you possess extraordinary magical ability, the potential and power of which will unlock should you prove yourself worthy. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Trials that you must complete on your own. Do you recall the pensive memory you viewed in my vault in Gringotts? You and your friend Charles spoke of the port key and of trials you'd created for one who could see traces of ancient magic. Precisely. Charles is another of the keepers, a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago in light of the knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. Until, perhaps, now. So, the passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. They were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. Now, I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, <laughs> in the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. Shall we have a look? 
And this ancient magic would have been really nice to just murderize Voldemort I know in one that hit. Tower. It's not far. You may have seen it yourself. Uh, thank you, Mick. That's a good, that's a solid tip. I appreciate you. It looks familiar. <laughs> Perhaps your young friend is more well-traveled than you might think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join mm -hmm. me as soon as you can. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, be careful and do not tell anyone where you're going. But yet we continuously tell people exactly what we're doing. Literally, like, everybody. <laughs> I'm going to go collect the things from my collections menu right now. I think I have quite a few things to collect, actually. Ah, yes. Whatever that is. Wait, quests? We got this. Wait, what am I collecting from here? Remember to collect rewards from your collections menu. Don't they collect automatically? Like, I've seen all of these things. Maybe I'm mistaken. Go tell somebody. Is it challenges? Maybe it's the challenges menu that you meant. Uh... Yeah, there we go. It's the challenges menu. There we go. Ooh, that's a pretty nice cape. Look at that. The legendary cape. The uh, legendary armor attire. Shoo! Glasses. Okay. We have field guide pages. Got all of these bad. Oh, there's a freaking top hat! Let's go! Oh, baby! A freaking top hat. Oh, baby, baby. What is that? The dragon hide protector's cloak? That's pretty cool. Defeat Inferni. Amanda, thank you for the five gift memberships, you wonderful human. Wow, we got a whole bunch of stuff going on here. We got a top hat, baby. We're gonna put that on right now. It's only cosmetics. Wait, that's not a head. Okay, it is only cosmetic. Isn't is it? Yes, cosmetic top hat. Nailed it. What was the uh freaking armor? That looks ridiculous. I do like this this coat though with the top hat, looking pretty fire. Ooh, ooh, baby. Uh, logging into Hogwarts as we speak. There goes my productivity for the day. Oh lord, oh lord. Good luck. Oh yeah, now we're looking baller. Look at this. All right, we're gonna keep. I kind of like the way this looked though. But this looks pretty fancy. Anthony, thank you for the four months. I hope everybody's enjoying the uh, the series so far. Y'all are a wonderful. Thank you so much. You found a top hat in Hogsmeade. Nice. You need some new fishnets. Lord have mercy. So we got some quests. Uh, we got Depulso Glacius, Wingardium Leviosa. Let's see here. I think we should unlock Wingardium Leviosa, Professor Garlic's assignment number one. Acquire and use a venomous tentacula. Acquire and use a mandrake or multiple on multiple enemies simultaneously. Lord half mercy. Okay, so I guess we're gonna throw mandrakes at people. That means we need to, I think we need to go to Hogsmeade real quick. Do more of the Merlin quest. I do have a couple of them unlocked. We need to go to this dude right here. We need a walking stick to hide our wand in. That's Dark Wizard 101. It seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Truth. Such truth. This is pretty dark wizardy attire that I've got going on right now. Uh, we might have to find a nice clothing store or something. Am I like having a stroke right now? Where am I? A yeah, walking stick would be fire. Are you open? Oh, you. What a pleasant surprise! All right, what do we got? Seed packets. We got knot grass, flux weed. 
Mallow sweet and shrivel blah 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 blah. Fertilizer. Where do we get the mandrake stuff? Um, I want like ooh, seeds are expensive. Unlocks the ability to grow flux weed in large pots. Oh, large pots. Small pots? We only have small pots right now. Now you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. We don't have medium pots either. Hey Tank, just joined the community. Love your content and love watching you play games. P.S. I use your favorite monster as my profile picture. Oh God, not the one that tongues you, Melissa. Melissa, from school tag. Okay. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. That's true. Nobody can say that. Can't say that. Mallow's sweet. Let's go ahead and wait until daytime. Melissa, thank you so much. I love how, like, when you sleep, it's just like, even if it's nighttime, it's still gonna stay nighttime. You gotta do it twice. Uh, LJ, thank you for the 17 months. FYI, you need like 3K each for the large brewing station and large pots. <sighs> Anthony, thank you so much. Loving the series? Hell yeah. Mandrakes in the greenhouse. That's what I thought, but I don't remember seeing them there. I've been in the greenhouse a few times now. Mandrake are sold at Dogweed and Deathcap in Hogsmeade. Well, butter my butt and call me now? a biscuit. I know we can acquire Tentalica here. We have to use one. I don't believe there's any Mandrake here, but... We'll see while we're here. Might as well take a look-see since we traveled here. There are maps up where all the 500 chests are located, and apparently just around Hogwarts you can get 12k. Yeah, it's, there's tons of those chests. Super easy to get money in the game. Super duper easy. Alright, so somebody said it was Dogweed and Deathcap. Where's that? Pippins and potions. It's the blood and peck. Have I not found that place yet? It's north a wee bit. All right. Well, we'll go. We'll go here and we'll find it. Hogs meet. Here I come. Oh, Matthias, awesome. Plus, we need to buy our broom. We finally unlocked the quest for, um, what was that? Oh, this is a side quest, a demanding delivery. Speak with Perry Pippin. Sporting good shot to sell a variety of brooms. Let's go here first. Let's buy our first broom. It's gonna help a lot. I need a dark wizard top hat. This one's a little too green. But we need our first broom. And also, thank you all for the continued support on this series. Truly, truly appreciate it. You have no idea. Thank you so very much. Ah, oh, new face. Wonderful. Revelio. Revelio, your mamio. Yes. Give me my first broom, Abley. Hello. Mr. Weeks, is it? Alby Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned, thankfully with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Mm -hmm. Got a few rare yew weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows, wind wisps too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Well, thank you, sir. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. All right, what do we what got? What do we got? What do we got? Today? How much these is? Ah, the Wind Wisp broom. Then we've got the Hogwarts House broom. Interesting. Ember Dash. They're all 600. 
Um, do you want to use a house broom? This one has a little saddlebag in it. Moon trimmer, finely crafted from ash. This broom is built for stability. Stylish broom with a light touch. Quite literally. Fiery temperament. Ooh, the ember dash. Preview broom. That item is of the highest quality. Ooh, look at that bad boy. Hmm, not, not so much that one. All right, we're going with the ember dash. 600 You'll be gold. With that broom, I promise you. Thanks for stopping by. I, whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements. Absolutely, Albie. Ha! Knew I was right about you. I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct a broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. Okay, that seems happens, easy enough. Another Hogwarts student, Imelda Rays, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? I think that sounds uh, like a brilliant plan. That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Reyes will sort you out. Well, at least they figured out something to do with the Quidditch time. pitch, right? Sure, let me know. Rebellion. The charming school cloak. Ooh, this is a biggly wiggly chest. What we got in here? Protect Nothing, <sighs> because our inventory is thick. All right, what? Oh, can we sell some stuff to this dude? Bruh. His enthusiasm. I'm thick. I need some help. What are we looking for today? All right, we're going to sell all of our Garbungo stuff. Nice doing business with you. It takes so long to sell stuff. Our inventory is hot garbage. I'm sure there's a way to upgrade that. We just haven't gotten to do it yet. <gasps> Ooh, that's close. Thanks for stopping by. I hope, hope there's a way to again. increase your inventory. Me too. Ah, yes, the wooden spectacles. What every young witch and wizard needs. All right, how do we fly? Take flight. Hoppa! Oh, flying is not available at the moment. You can craft items. You can upgrade it after a few of Merlin's trials. Yeah, I, I found a couple Merlin's trials. We're going to maybe do a few of them today. Uh, but we need to figure out where we can buy those Wampin' Dude Bros. Ah, Dogweed and Death Cat. It's up here. Heba, hubo, ah, get in there. That's not right. I saw it. We're on our. All right, so we're gonna do some Merlin's trials. Y'all, I don't even know. Y'all, y'all been watching a lot of videos, haven't you? Or been grinding hard. Thick looks like you should be running a novelty store. Ex freaking excuse me. Rebellio. Rude. Mightily freaking rude. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Am I Thank you. Mm. I hope those crazy people on Twitter don't try and harass tag playing this game. Oh, I've gotten plenty of harassment already. Multiple times a day. Come on inside. Revelio. What's your sales for? Revelio in that booty. I, I do need a serious top hat for sure. Hello. Oh, hello. Whew. Sorry, I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I'm in a tizzy too, ma'am. I know. I get it. And nipping. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way. Beatrice Green is the name, but 
you may address me as Madam Green. Ah, Madam Green. Welcome to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, uh, mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there wasn't the constant demand for antidotes, I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little dears. Except, of course, for curses. And, well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Or if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead, and I'm in no mood for a clear-up. May I see your wares, you ma'am? I doth request some mandrakes well, so I can finish this quest. Well, let me show you some of what's available. Ooh, two mandrakes, and we got the venomous ten- Oh my god, it's so expensive. Mandrake and small pots. Perfect. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. Oh, I'm gonna go far. I'm gonna go so far. So I can grow Mandrake now. I'm 99.9% .9 sure I already have Venomous Tentacula. Doors always but open. I can grow Mandrake now. Which is spicy goodness. So the question is, how do I... Ah, yes, I do. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna eat some booty with those. And we're gonna go and grow some Mandrake real quick in Hogwarts. We gotta go to the secret rooms and then to the room of requirement. They really need to buff how you make money. I'll have a money making video soon. Like obviously you can do all of the little like bog art chests or whatever they are. Um, but obviously there's only a limited amount of those chests that one can acquire. You can get 15,000... You can get a lot of money really quick with those once you get the invisibility spell. But obviously, once they're gone, there's got to be another way for us to make money. I would like to empty the pot and put a mandrake in there, baby. Mandrake. Ten mini toes. We're going to make a couple of these mandrakes, I think. How many mandrake do we get from this? Ugh, one. I should have known that. All right, we're gonna do that a few times then. Actually, I guess we'll do a full round of mandrake. Yeah, selling gear does seem to be incredibly consistent. Gear sells for about, I mean, good gear too. I mean, it, it sells pretty well. I've got a couple ideas for some money making videos. I've worked on a few. I was putting together a chest video, but um, didn't finish it yet. But the bartender in Hogsmeade apparently is the first trans person in the game. I mean, probably. That's what I was thinking. I mean, you can make a trans person in the game if you want, but... The, um... We don't need to get into that now, because I'm already getting enough hate for playing the game as it is. Not grass? Yeah, let's make some of that. Especially upgraded gear sells for a lot, but you need room of requirement to get the upgraded gear. Truth. <laughs> uh, I don't need to change this. All right, we gotta go find some things to murderize. So I think we'll go and do some of our Merlin's trials real quick. There is one right here. I guess we'll fast travel right here. We'll go do that one real quick. Another adventure, are we? Man, the game is just so pretty. And so well done, too. Now, we've like, encountered like a couple like little glitches and things, but for the most part, absolutely amazing. Revelio. There's a thingy maboop here somewhere. Must be inside. How much did I pay for the game? I don't know. Money? You can Google how much it is. <laughs> A 
Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Yes, Merlin. One mallow sweet. Shazam. What must we do today? Uh. Oh, we got a ball? Okay. What's the ball doing? Revelio. Interesting. What's going on with this one? Do we light it on? I don't think we light it on fire. Incendio. Certainly not. Oh, I see. Akio. We just roll it with our face. Levioso. Oh, you know what? I don't have. I probably don't have the stuff for it. Confringo. Oh, that might do it if I keep hitting it with that. Life hacks, baby. I'm a freaking wizard. Gregory, thank you for the 10 gift memberships again. Sweet baby Jesus. Thank you so much. Oh, no. Oh, no. Gregory, thank you so freaking much. Confirm. Merlin trials won't get the best of me. Haha. Uh -huh. Tag cheese in it. That's how I roll, you know? <laughs> when in doubt, blast it. Sometimes that's how it be, you know? Akio! Thank you so much for the super chat, you wonderful human. Thank you. Incendio. I don't know what that did. I feel like I completed this already. First time I came through here, which opened the door to begin with. Yeah. Revelio. Totes. And then I started blasting. Hey, sometimes you just gotta blast, you know? Pork lump juice, baby. What the hell is that? Oh, oh, you about to tongue me, son? Come here. Come here. Levioso. Hmm. I'm not messing with that thing. Not all today. Hey, Gregory, thank you so much. Back to lurk working. Oh, Lord. Lord have mercy. How to get that top piece? It's all from the collection or the uh, challenges. Completing challenges challenges gives you rewards that you can collect in the game. Hmm, there's another Merlin's challenge over here. Moo! What do you have in store for me this time? Oh, I gotta stick some balls in there? All right, who's got my balls? Aha! Levioso. Oh, Lord. Uh. Levi. Wingardium Leviosa would work a lot better for this. Accio. I'm also gonna have to stick my balls in here like that. <laughs> well Wait, is there another one? Oh, you need some more balls. Okay. 
Levioso. Akio. Is there another one? Revelio. There must be. Ooh, what's this? <coughs> you guys want barbecue beef? Y'all are so rude. I'll barbecue the beef if you want. Confringo. Whoops. Oh no! Are you okay? You're gonna get back up? Incendio. Confringo. <laughs> Revelio. How could you? I look like an evil leprechaun. <laughs> Screw you! Man. <sighs> right, where's the rest of the uh, the thingamaboobs around here? I don't see any more. Oh, there, there's some balls. <laughs> Voldemort, I seek immortality. Meanwhile, some random cow. Accio. Sometimes it'd be like that, you know? So tricky. Oh, Kayla, thank you so much for the five gift memberships and welcome all the members, Eric, Harlow, Ireland Rose, Jamara, and Chicklet. What it do? What that was. It's making weird noises at me. You want some of this? The dark wizard Hufflepuff? You can't take this. You can't handle the truth. Wait, what was that? 21 gold in a freaking tree? Ex freaking excuse me? Oh, look at this. It's not weird at all. Revelio. The Herbridine Black Scale, a large dragon that can grow to over nine meters in length. A large rough scale, originally belonging to one of these beasts, is one of the prized possessions that Archie Bickle keeps in his hideout. Is that who that is right there? Daniel M. Thank you for the 45 months. Look at that freaking bird. Stop by for a bit while I play hooky from work for a few. Game is beautiful. Not my kind of game, but I dig watching it. Not your kind of game. You mean the best game ever? It couldn't be your game? It's all right, Daniel. I wish you the best. Hope you're doing well. What do we got in the spicy hole? Revelio. Confringo. Mm. Incendio. Mm -hmm. Revelio. Revelio, indeed. I don't think I have the yeah. ability to get in there quite yet. Man, I this saw. Looks intriguing. So many things to murder earlier. Now I can't find a single one to murder. There was murdering things all up in this place yesterday or, or earlier today. Have we seen any cool magical beasts yet? Not yet. Okay, we need to throw a dark mogul. Oh Christ. Is 
it working? Good lord. Oh my god, it looked like its head fell off. Alright, so we definitely used one of those. Those are kind of cool. Man, using plants is good. Shazam! They do a lot of damage. Are you winning, son? Always winning. Mongrel fur. Whoops. Incendio. Oh, wow. Incendioed the bejesus out of that thing. Can you put your zoom zoom on the broom broom? Ha! Pfft. How do I do that? I would love to. So you don't need to talk to Merlin afterwards? Uh... Make sure to do the potato spell for me. Always potatoing. All right, how do I fly? Haba. Haba. Potato. Potato. I know a Merlin trial when I see one. Hmm. Revelio. What does that ball do? There's a couple balls around. Hmm. If I was a ball wizard, what would this do? Hmm. Incendio. Nope. Accio. Oh. Oh, there's a lot of balls up in this joint. I should investigate. Is that it? Revelio. Who's got more balls? Shut up, sheep. I will explodify you. Did I not win? I feel like I won. Investigate, AKA destroy. Huh. Revelio. There must be one. Singular one that I missed somewhere. Ain't no balls where I roam. Ain't no balls anywhere. Ain't no balls where I roam. No, 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 no. Ain't balls nowhere. It's a cow. Revelio. Pretty sure I got all the ball. Oh, super secret squirrel ball. Accio. That's that. Settled. Ta-da! We did it. Am I supposed to talk to this dude? No. Okay, you made me panic. I was like, oh, shoot. I got a broom, baby. Brooming so good. Brooming so great. Whoa. Can we crash into a tree? Nope. <laughs> Is 
It's so quiet up here. <clears throat> oh. I'll do this first one and then... Oh, there's gotta be something up here. Gotta be. Oh, how do I do it? Protego. Confringo. Oh no! Okay, it's alive. It's alive. Oh god, I didn't think I was gonna be able to murder it. Revelio. Oh no. <laughs> Have I done? I'm a monster. A new meaning of rotisserie chicken. Oh no. Hey you, Hufflepuff. Who are you calling Hufflepuff? Amelda Rays? Albi Week sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. The nerve, Why is he indeed. You into this broom testing silliness. You've barely started flying, from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. You sound jealous. Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me, Slytherin Quidditch captain, jealous of you. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. Dang. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Hufflepuff. Okay, let's freaking go. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. Uh, unlikely, ma'am. Okay, where are we supposed to go? Oh yeah, she's done. What's this? Speed boost? Ooh, what was that noise? Oh, Lord. Yeah, let's go. Oh, this is actually kind of hard. Oh. Oh, oh. Oh, man. Quidditch would have been so hard. Lord, no wonder they cut it. Uh-uh. That camera ink, the control? Not easy. <laughs> now that's more like it. I feel like Success. I'm drunk. I feel like I'm in freaking Jurassic Park right now. Brilliant. Find it. You can do this. Stop sucking. Stop sucking. We gotta embarrass Slytherin. Oh yeah, she's done. She's freaking done. Doesn't stand a chance. The ring? Oh, did anyone else see that? Did I miss a ring? Or was the ring at the end? 
Ugh, that's not... You, you must have cheated, you... Ugh. Fine, you won. <sighs> Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself. You literally you built the course respect. and couldn't do it faster. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. You and everyone else need to get a thicker skin. <coughs> anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to. Uh. Well then, <laughs> unexpected problem. Let's see if the autosave actually worked. Broomhilda. She's such a loser, she crashed the game. Ain't that right? Oh, piss off. Stuck me right back on the broom. I guess I need the practice anyways, it's okay. So we got camera, pitch, and like, yaw. All right, so the problem is with this, the reason why it feels so weird is because you have two different controls, so like, the right on the thumbstick controls up and down, but also your left and right camera movement. Like, it doesn't make any sense. It's super weird that they would split the camera controls Success. to two different things. It makes no sense at all. I don't know who thought of it, but you're on crack. Doesn't make any sense. Feels super awkward. I'm sure there's a setting for it. Brilliant. Did it. So the problem is, so like I can move up and down with the right stick, but I have to move left and right with the left. Well, sorry, I can move up and down with the right stick. But I have to move left to right with the left stick. But I also have to control the camera for left and right with the right stick. And the camera for up and down with the left stick. <laughs> I'm gonna lose this time. This is rather fun. <laughs> this is rather fun. But yes, I'm going to check the settings for that because that is just atrocious. Um, controls. All right, so invert camera access, invert flight, flight controls. I guess we'll try that and see what happens. You won. <sighs> Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Eh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. You and everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Oh, I'm Just good. check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. Mm hmm. A fluke, you say? <laughs> Oh, 
So now it's... I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear how I fared. It's just inverted now. I do like that, though. It feels a little bit better. The camera is still wonky, but... We're good. So we need to return to Albi Weeks. That'll get our first upgrade for us, at the very least. Man, getting to fly over Hogwarts? Hell yeah. Room vote, name the broom. I know, you keep wanting me to name it Broomhilda. I got it, I saw it. Trust me, I saw it. Skirt, skirt. Is there haptics for flying? Yeah, so all that air and stuff is, uh, I'm getting haptic feedback for that. Which is pretty cool. I like it. Skirt, skirt. You can't enter while mounted? Lame. Hup, okay. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Muggles have made life. All roads lead to Hogsmeade, baby. Oh, you're back! We've something to report, I hope. Mr. Wheats, I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible! Miss Ray's must have been shocked. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent, and it's wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that it tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Oh, thank you. Hmm. That's precisely what I needed to know. Drifted, eh? Filda. I shall get to work immediately. Lord, it's a good one. Even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my work's had potential all along. I'm excited to hear more. I I'm sure we're going to get an owl from him at some point. point. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Oh, we gotta go Expect get our mandrakes now. So we gotta go get our mandrakes, because then we can get Wingardium Leviosa. Leviosa. Hogwarts map. The secret rooms in the room of requirement. Yeah, I think uh, Broomfilda definitely makes makes sense. Not grass sprigs. One mandrake. Oh, it doesn't scream at us. I need to make flux weed. I just murdered a mandrake. I don't know how to feel about that. Didn't I get flux weed stuff? I know we're going to need Malice, please. Definitely going to need more of that. This would have been great as a mobile game. <laughs> what? That would get annoying really fast. Oh, for sure. For sure. Okay, let's go find something to murder with our wonderful new abilities. Let's see what's out here. Oh. Oh, shoot. Didn't even think about us, this being the freaking evil woods of death. Can I climb up this wall? Wait, can I fly in here? Hup. 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 Oh, my swiggity swooty after that booty. Take up Mandrake! 
Oh, that's kind of oh, nice, sorry. actually. Uh, let's see here. We need to go R2 and then... Oh, whoa. Calm your butts there, Batman. And you know what? That does... You know what? Die. Oh! Oh, that was brutal. <laughs> Lord hath mercy. All right, so we got to go to Herbology Glass. Pop balloons over Hogsmeade Station for Glacius. Uh, let's do that right now. My God, just summoning frickin' Thor on their face. Incendio. Is this a puzzle? Oh, that's a hundred percent a puzzle. What this is? Incendio. That's a little something something. I don't know what it is yet. Six out of ten pots. What do we? We need two more. This is just a pot breaking puzzle. Uno mas. Oh, I see you. What? Oh. Oh, hello. What in Sam Hill is this? What you doing there, buddy? The Dark Arts Battle Arena. Oh, this is how you unlock the Dark Arts Battle Arena. That's freaking cool. Oh, look at that sneaky stuff. Oh, and now we get to test out all of the dark arts. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, how about you die? Oh! Oh! Oh no! Oh! Oh! Oh, Lord, have mercy. Oh, right in the taint. Nothing like getting... Oh, 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 Ashwinder Ranger, that's me. Oh my god, Crucio. I think we get an award for this at some point. How about you just explode? Oh, boy. What you want? I defeated an Ashwinder by myself. An Ashwinder, you say? Right, so there's gonna be another wave. Sorry, I'm realizing. Oh, realizing the game volume was very loud. My bad. Oh Lord, have mercy! You know what? How about you just die? Yeah, your friend is gone. Ooh, Lord, I'm about to die. <laughs> Bonk. Imperial. Where's the last one at? Can you name your broom after your house in Red Dead Redemption 2? Or horse. Yeah, we called it Broomfilda. Is that guy still alive up there? Yep. That was rude. I thought you would only play the game during live stream. Seems he kept playing offline. What a shame. Fabio. That's not true at all. Did you join the live stream an hour late, maybe? Stupendous, your mom. Oh, baby. Oh, bye bye now.
Oh, whoa, lordy, lordy, lordy. Oh, lord. Oh my god, I just bonkified the Christ out of that thing. These are definitely getting harder now. Ooh. Oh, Christ. This is actually kind of hard. There's so many. Even with the killing curse, it's still a lot of stuff going on. The counterattacks are incredibly important. You know what? You die. Bye bye. We got two more to kill. We need to get stronger att attacks. Whew. All right, how many freaking waves are there in here? Ooh, level 18, baby. This is a good way to low. Oh, big orc boy. Ha ha ha. Bye-bye. Ha! I didn't know there was two of them. But you know what? Ah, bye-bye. Oh, wow, our ancient magic didn't kill it in one hit. That's a whoop. Whoop! Scoop! Ah! Lord have mercy, this thing is level 20. I like that it just beat itself up. There we go. Back damage. That's what I'm talking about. Those ragdoll physics. Oh, I can't get the back damage. Oh. Killing curse is almost ready. Yourself. Man, these mountain trolls are beasts. Bye bye. Woo! Nice my large friend. You let Nora <laughs> go. Oh no! About to wish you had a <laughs> 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 Man, How many freaking waves are there up in here? Lord, the killing curse is beast. I love that the forbidden curses go through shields, though. Boom. shot me. I mean, I already had low health, but god dang! Alright, that's pretty cool. So that's how you unlock that. Whew. Cool, 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 cool. We gotta go attend stuff, uh, herbology class, so we can get Wingardium and Leviosa. Timothy, it's part of the 
PlayStation 5 pre-order. You get to use all of the unforgivable curses in that room only at any point in time. It's part of the uh, PlayStation 5 bonuses for a pre-order. And Deluxe Edition, I think. Or is it just the Deluxe Edition? I can't remember if it's... I'm sorry, I can't remember if it's uh, a PlayStation 5 bonus or a Deluxe Edition bonus. I think it's the Deluxe Edition bonus. The Dark Wizard pack. You know? I need to figure out a way, if there's a way to reduce the volume of combat while keeping the rest of the volume high. I'm assuming it's sound effects volume. Developers really need to do a better job of allowing us more freedom. For volume adjustment. I mean, it's not just a streamer problem. I gotta find all those balloons. I saw a ton of them. I don't know where they all are right now, though. Ah, uh, there they are. Hogs meet, here I come. Oh, Christ, that was loud. How does the game look on uh, on Steam, everybody? Uh, I haven't gotten to play it on Steam yet. Um, I know. I'm, I imagine some people are playing it on PC instead of PlayStation. How's it look? Does it run well? Does it look better than the PlayStation version? I mean, it probably looks better than the YouTube version of this for sure, since YouTube's compression is literally disgusting. I think that's the last one right there. It looks amazingly amazing. Nice. It's a quest down there. Is that all of them? Alright, Hogsmeade Station, so there's one more here somewhere. And we gotta go to the Quidditch pitch. I don't see another balloon anywhere. You hear there's more issues with the PC version as far as bugs and glitches go? I mean, that sounds about right. Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. Oh, nope, down. Boink. Oh my god. Boink. I just want to get all these little side quests done. I've been wanting to test it on the PC version. I probably will, just to see what it looks like in comparison. Is the Twitch drops? No. The, the stream today was so bad, I only got to 80%. I'm super miffed about it. Super duper butthurt about it. I wonder if Fabio disappeared, even though they came in an hour late into the stream, didn't know what was going on, and got mad at me for it. That's like sums up the human race at this point, right now. Sup, I'm waiting for my Steam Deck to complete my download so I can jump in and make a badass Gryffindor. Playing it on my 75 inch, so I reckon I'll be pretty much the same as PF1. Pretty, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Brave soul using a Steam Deck on a 75-inch TV. I hope it works awesome for you, though. I know it is uh, approved or uh, tested and all that stuff, so it should be good prices, right? Thank you so much for the super chat, you wonderful human. And Trash Panda Manda. Hope you've been well. So glad to catch you live. But am I working on a secret project? Oh, hell yeah. Trash, I hope you have been well, you wonderful, wonderful human. 
All right, Uno Mas Balloon. One balloon, please. I really, I can see why they didn't do Quidditch. They could, the flying camera stuff in control is not good. I mean, it's not bad, but it's also not good. At all. Like, Quidditch would have been impossible. Um, maybe I'm just being nitpicky about it, but good. I mean, I'm new to the, the whole flight control thing right now, but it's just not into, it's, I mean, it's, I don't know. It's literally the only thing I could find to complain about the game so far right now. But good lord is it terrible. Like, I can't even hit the freaking balloon. Hup. Hup. It's like, why would you put the camera... There we go. Like, just... Like, what were you thinking? Who did this? I want to have words with you. Brilliant. <laughs> I'll figure it out, though. I'm sure once I get used to it, it won't be so bad. <laughs> Good lord. Alright, so quests. We would like to do... Wingardium Leviosa. So we need to attend her biology class. Ooh, and we have new owl posts, too. Um, oh, well, hello, Madame Kagawa. It's time you learned Glacius, the freezing spell. It's an efficient way to cool down a heated situation. But first, I will need you to complete a few ta- I already did it! You dirty, dirty girl. Greetings, I'm happy to report my sister Helen survived the sudden attack in Azkaban. She said that she does not hold a grudge against Anne. As terrible and vicious as it was. Yeah, she's alive, that's cool. Absolutely no FOV settings. A hundred percent true. Hundred percent true. Uh, dark Arts Core. Ooh, Room of a Requirement. Yas. For each Chinese chomping cabbage thrown, a second chomping cabbage is generated. Oh my god. Makes you invulnerable and deflects projectiles attack to back to enemies for the Endurance Potion. Oh snap. Some of these talents are... All of these talents are really freaking good. Confringo compacts produce firebolts that seek enemy targets. What? These talents, they're all freaking great. I haven't found a garbage one yet. More like the Nimbus 420. Lord. Somebody come get her. It's about to take a class. What are you up to now? I'm taking a course. Man, I look like a pimp. The, the classes are interesting. Good to see you again. Like, that wasn't really a class, per se. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be, too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. When will you cast the Professor, Professor though? Heckett That's tells me the she question. taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a Leviosa. nice, graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. We 100% need a darker top hat. When executed correctly, you should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezewort. Boom. Boom. 
Wingardium Leviosa. A levitation charm. Can levitate and move objects. Control its position with your movement. We also very, very well, much done. need to adjust some things. I have too many thingamaboobs here and not enough thingamabobs, you know? So we need to have that. So we've got Confringo. I definitely like Confringo more, so I need to have... Uh... uh Expelliarmus, maybe down here. And then we'll go up. I need to plan all of this out more. Like, I want to make sure we have all of our blue spells on one side. So we're going to do boink, boink, and a habonk, and a stoopy doop, and a haboink right there. So that's all four of those. That's all four of those on one. Then we have that. And I guess here we can put a uh, splody fire dude right there. So at least that way we can do more things. All right, so we learned a new spell. We can learn another spell here in a moment too. Secret rooms, we should go pick up our stuff from the room of requirement. Mandrakes seem positively useful, though. All right, we got plenty of Mallow Sweet Leaves. All right, let's see what next quest we've got. Meet the Professor Fig at the tower. I feel like we should... Oh, I kind of want Depulso. Acquire and use a Focus Potion. Acquire Maxima and Endurus Potions and use them simultaneously? How in Sam Hell do you do that? Endurance potion, we can make a couple of those. It's a Maximo one though. Purchase from JJ Pippins and stuff. Right, let's make a couple of these. And then while these are crafting, well, it only takes 30 seconds. Whoops. You hope so? You need the lore? The lore for what? I do want to know why he seems to have just not been educated for 15 years, though. That is a really good question. I've been wondering the same for a while. Let's fast travel to JJ Pippins and stuff over in Hogsmeade. Whoops. So many rainbow people today. Everybody up here upgrading. Y'all fantastic. JJ Pippins and stuff. Also, ladies and gentlemen, if you do find yourselves enjoying the live stream, a like would be greatly appreciated. It helps out so much. Does it I would get greatly any more appreciate cozy the support. than Hogsmeade? Mr. Pippins. Oh, it's literally right here. GG. Oh my god, I just explodified that. <laughs> my well, bad. Do you let me know if I can be of any assistance at all? What can I do for you today? So I need the Maxima Potion. A wise decision. Invisibility Potion. Thunder Brew. A Damage Potion. Or a Focus Potion. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. All right, what's the, what's the other stuff that I need for this? A Focus Potion. I think we need to buy that from Dude Bro right here. That's a lot of money for a Focus Potion. What can I do for you God today? Dang, A wise Man. decision. Thank you. And you out here not even letting me sell 
like ingredients and stuff? Shoo! Violet Lucy, happy eight months. I Was it going to, to get this again. game? But you may have well, changed my mind. It's because it's so freaking good. Red Corgi, hell yeah, Caitlin. Let's freaking go. Lisa, welcome, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Caitlin, congratulations again on the red corgi. Felix Felicis. I need the Maxima potion. Duras, and I need the focus potion. Ah, Fluxweed. Where the hell do we get Fluxweed? That's posing a freaking problem. Fluxweed must be grown in large pots. Where the hell do I get large pots from? Sounds like a video. Where in Sam Hell do I get a largeth poteth? Purchase from tomes and scrolls. a small pot with three small pots. No, I need a large pot. Large potting tables. Purchased from tomes and scrolls. 30 moonstone for one? Engorgio a small pot? I'll engorgio something. These plants. Tomes and scrolls. Where's that? Is it down here? Lord hath mercy. Well, Timothy, he's got a British accent, so I don't think he's from America. I mean, I'm no rocket scientist or anything, but... I do imagine he's probably Muggle-born, though, if I were to guess. It would explain why he wasn't invited or learned magic anytime soon. Sooner? Let's look at what we have, The before times? Medium pots. 3,000 doll hairs! With five small dung composter, potting table with two large. I just want one large pot with a large pot spellcraft. No. <sighs> yes. One thousand doll hairs. Nothing like finding just the right thing. Is oh yeah, I'll find the right thing for your face. God dang it! Taking all my monies. All of them. Is this Harry Potter? This is Hogwarts Legacy. It's like Harry Potter, but not. How do I... How do I get rid of you? I would like you to just like not be here. That's what I want. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Oh, that's a biggly wiggly one. That one's gonna go right in the center. Oh, wait, no, it's gonna go. Oh, I have none. None of this is centered because you can't center it because developers don't care about OCD. How do I remove an item then? How do I delete a Epicus Deletus? Is it? A, is it? Um, maybe I have to cancel empty pot first. Then it's not growing anything, and then I can just delete us it. 
No. Use Evanesco spell? What? Ah! Oh, you can disable snapping. That's what y'all meant. It's the poofy one. Thank you. Forgot about that one. Big old boy -o coming in hot. Dittany, Mallow Sweet. Oh no. Oh no. Purchase from the Magic Neep. Oh my god dang it, Bobby. I need to center this or I'm gonna lose my freaking mind. Oh, oh it snaps in the middle. Oh, I could kiss everybody who made this game right now. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Oh, baby. I have an honest question, if you will. Because we are able to link our wizarding account, is it possible if I play this on another platform, I just simply log into my Wonder Blurs on my PS4 and resume my Steam progress? I do not believe so. I don't know if there is cross save. I've not seen any information about cross save. Ooh, it would be super cool if they did. I will, oh man, I've not seen anything about it. Unfortunately, as far as I'm aware, there is no cross save. You can only link accounts. Yeah, there's no cross save as far as I know. Hogs meet, here I come. Which is a big bummer because I would literally love it if there was. It would be the thing that pushed it over the edge. Like, like Ubisoft does that a lot now with a lot of their things. Hello. Cross save would, you have, in a bit. would have done a lot of really good things for this game. So we need Fluxweed. Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help I you with. I can't, because I'm broke, because your stupid face no made me spend all my money. Stack shelf. Would cause problems with some platforms have unique bonuses. That's the developer's problem, not ours. Like, to not do cross-save for the sake of giving bonuses to other platforms would be ridiculous. But it would cause problems currently with the way they have done things, yes. All right, one flux weed, please. We are getting our our growing on. We got 25 seconds on the Mala Suite and Mandrake, so 14 freaking minutes. Okay, we'll just come back for that. All right, back to the questy times. All right, so we want to do the main quest of Percival Rackham's trial. Meet Professor Fig at the tower of doom. Oh, Lord have mercy. Where's this tower at? Oh, ha, dang, it's way out there. Thankfully, we've got a broom now. Your room looks different from the trailer's room of requirement. Are there upgrades? Yeah, uh, I can do a full video on, you, you, can, you can change the, the room of requirement up quite a bit, actually. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Hey, y'all should look at getting a membership. It's only $1 a month and you get access to members' Discord along with the Corgi icon. 
It's true. That is the uh, the lowest going rate right now. I actually have three videos that y'all are going to be getting in Discord um, tonight and tomorrow for early access videos as well. Also, we have a section in Discord for those of you that don't know right now for all Hogwarts secrets, whether I make a video or not. Y'all can post in that Discord for anything that you find while playing the game. Uh, and that not only helps you out, but also helps me figure out uh, content for videos. So if y'all want to get a shout out for things that you find, uh, make sure to post in there. But also make sure to just post in there in general for all of your fellow community members. Yeah, I know I misspelt it, Over Bungalist. Here. Life is hard, okay, Bungie? Life is hard. And I'm dyslexic, and I can't type, and it's just a nightmare. We're not alone. We are not. Ranrock's loyalists. Around a dozen, I can see, but could be more. Can't we operate past them into the tower? We could, but we've no idea what's in the tower. More importantly, however, I'd like to know why they're here. They've set up camp just ahead. I suggest we investigate a little before doing anything else. Let's go. Well, this isn't ideal. No, it isn't. This way. And I'd suggest we use the disillusionment charm here. No sense in announcing our arrival. Truth? Those goblins in my family weren't in the mines at one time or other. Is bro not gonna do it? He's not gonna do it. Quickly now. Yeah, I already did it, bruh. Ooh, can we assassinate people with a wand? Stay hidden and cast Petrificus. Petrificus Totalis. <laughs> well done. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna get her. Shazam! You're a totalist. A oh boy. Oh, sucks to suck, son. Give me your gold. If only I could get my hands on Fig. Oh, the you can't get your hands on nothing because you are a totalist. Carolina, thank you for coming to Bean. Welcome back to the community, you wonderful, wonderful human. Hello? Hello? Hello, governor. <laughs> oh, sucks to suck. If only you could see invisible people. Assassin's Creed Hogwarts edition, baby. Totalis and the bejesus out of everybody. Oh, if only you could see how you gonna get screwed up right now. Patrificus Totalis. Someone there. Oh, just your mom. Such uh, bye -bye. Invisible lightning bolts from the sky. That's way too fun. That is way too freaking fun. You can cast a freaking lightning bolt from the sky while invisible. That is broken. Did we do it? I need this ability for The Last of Us. Oh my god. Revelio. Reveal your secrets, game. Mm, baby's first assassination. Oh no. Baby Blood Moon. Let's freaking go. Getting them level ups. Orders. Search Directly the tower from surrounding area. Look for anything to do with names. Something to do with names. What names? Fine, and I didn't want to read here? it. Game. Do you need to invisibility yourself? No, I just need to find that. Uh, I think I need to find it. Hello, governor. I will draw blood. I'll draw blood from your face. You're the prettiest Prepare goblin I've seen go. so far. Ah. Whoops. Oh my god, y'all are just exploding! Ah, you got no weapon! Oh, Lord. 
Oh, what happened to you? You want some exploding ball? Happy birthday, baby Blood Moon. Thank you, RM. Always been antagonistic towards wizard kind, but this is different somehow. I hate how loud the game Looks gets like during combat. Looks like we found combat. the entrance. Yeah, I found the entrance a while ago, buddy. How about you catch it's up, locked. old man? An unlocking charm. Very handy. No time now, but if you don't learn it soon enough, we can work on it back at the castle. Oh, thank you, God. Give me the pick-locking ability, you dirty old man. I wonder who this is. With ropes like that, it could be anyone. Someone was an avid reader. Can't say I'm familiar with many of these titles. Alohomora. Exactly. That's exactly what we need to get a lot of the really nice items in the game, too. But we can't get that yet, because the game won't let us. Welcome we need to, to San Bacar's Tower. Welcome to your mom's tower. Open it, old man! Do the thing. Confringo! Interesting. Is this like a hardcore Harry Potter game? It's, uh, sure. Yeah. Revelio. Search the tower. Oh, there's a little something, something, something down there. That's not what we're looking for, though. I was literally just up there. an investigate icon here. There it is. Nope. Where the... Revelio. I saw an investigate pop up, right? Like, I'm not losing my freaking mind. I know I saw it. But where did it go? Wait. Is it that way? No. Mm. Oh! <laughs> Hello, Professor. Did you say Sam Bacar's tower? I did. Professor Bacar is a keeper you have yet to encounter. I'm glad to see that I was correct in presuming that we would Robin meet again soon after our last encounter. Though I surmise, based on the commotion I heard, that you did not have an easy time getting to me. We did not, Professor. We encountered goblins outside the tower. That goblins were aware of my vault is disquieting enough. But if they have also made a connection to this tower, then the threat may be greater than I thought. All the more reason for us to move forward. Downstairs, near the entry, a reservoir of ancient magic, like those you've seen before, has been unlocked. Command it to access a doorway. I'm afraid I cannot say more. As Professor Fig cannot join you, That's he and I will, in time, see you back at the map chamber. Remember what you see. We're going to need to understand how Ranrock's loyalists knew about a tower that once belonged to a keeper. For the moment, however... You've more important things to set your mind to. A reservoir of ancient magic, I believe? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Then I shall leave matters in your increasingly capable hands. That said, mm. be careful. I will, sir. I'll see you back in the map chamber. Ooh, 48 gold. A reservoir of ancient magic, downstairs near the entry. I will look, look. <clears throat> I will look for Sebastian's quest. 
when it pops up. I haven't seen it yet. Mora so bad. I just want to be able to get into all the buildings and stuff. The first trial of death. Oh! Nothing like seeing a pop-up that says you're going to be fighting before, higher level enemies. In Gringotts and the restricted section. The plot thickens. It ever thickens. Revelio. Must have done something. Best have a look around. You are outrageous. A little loot from chests is randomized. But, uh, should be alright. But also put it in the Discord for other people that are playing. For sure. Help help people out. Crimson Voyager Garb. The unfortunate thing is all chests in this game are randomized, except for a few. Oh, this, <laughs> this doesn't look good. Does not look good at all. Pretty sure all of these statues are gonna come alive and they're gonna try and kill me. And then we're gonna die. I do have those mandrakes though, which I don't think work on statues, but we'll find out. Mm. The biggest statue of Definitely coming alive. More traces of ancient magic. Something must be different. Revelio. Destroyed statues. Okay. Hmm. I can't just be a quinky dink, right? I guess it can be a quinky dink. I see where we're supposed to go. Maybe we're supposed to go back? doesn't feel right. <clears throat> hmm. Oh, there's another statue. I don't think the statues have anything to do with it. Oh. 
with the statues definitely don't have anything to do with it. Okay. What am I playing on? The Sexbox 5000? Hmm. Now let's go back the other way and see what happens. Something must be afoot. I see on the minimap where we're supposed to go. But I don't quite see how we're supposed to go. Oh. What? Why didn't this... Sh what? More traces of ancient magic. Something must be different. Okay, what am I missing here? Definitely missing something. I just don't see what it is. I'm, I'm, did I not walk back through this last time? Could have swore I did. Hello, These governor. Never a welcome sight. At least I know what to expect this time. Indeed. Ha! You ain't got no weapons, son. Oh, oh Christ. Oh no. I guess I should just explode this dude. And then maybe deal with these in the way deeming fit of annoying little creatures. Oh, stunned him. Ow! Confringo. Jesus. Confringo. Hmm. Ah. These look familiar. Whoops. Akio. That pulls us there. What's the potion? What's in that potion I could carry from an axe to the face? Uh. Huh. Secret sauce. Are you really asking if there's spoilers for the movies? The movies are like 30 years old. If you haven't watched them yet, that's your fault. What did that burst of magic do? Perhaps I should examine things from both sides of the archway. Akio! But yes, it has nothing to do with the movies. Completely separate. Ow. 
has nothing to do with JK Rowling either, but. <laughs> The movie has dragons, so it's kind of the, the same. Changes when I move more True. statues. Accio. Oh. oh my god, I just got my booty clapped. Expelliarmus. Confringo. That clap, son. Levioso. Confringo. I like that Confringo can interrupt. It's pretty nice. Whoa, hell yeah. Not making this easy on me. Screw these eggs. Oh, well, there's definitely stuff down there. Hmm. Those totally look like they're gonna attack. All right, I'm vibrating. The vibrations want me to go there. Akio. Mm hmm. I wonder which way I should go through this bad boy. to explore this archway from both Yeah, sides. I'll explore your mom from both sides. Oh, wait. Akio. Mm, I shouldn't have jumped down. Okay, it's a bit of a problem. You will not. She's elderly. <laughs> Grandmas need love too, okay? Mm. Misa think I messed up. What did that burst of magic change on both sides of the archway. Ba, 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 Something ba, ba, ba. must be different. Hmm. Okay, I think I have this right this time. Maybe? Huh. So I need... I need... I need no to see how the room changes when I move in and out of the Oh, outside. shut your freaking mouth. God. Why y'all gotta take the other PlayStation freaking console? Akio. Like, Forbidden West. The thing that pissed me off so much about Forbidden West, literally you couldn't play it for five seconds. Was it Forbidden West? What was it? No, God of War. It was God of War that did it. Infuriating. I so bet I just it. need to move it to the other I side. I need to use both sides of the archway to get the platform to the other side of the bridge. Whoops. I swear to God, I think Japan thinks Americans are just mentally challenged. 
and they force developers to make games with so that's stuff it. that I supports need to use that. Both sides of the archway to get the platform to the other side of the bridge. I mean, yeah, I'm not doing the greatest, but I'm not doing the worstest. This game is gonna chug on the switch. Yeah, that's why it got delayed. Are you sure we're not? I mean, I'm not saying that. Akio. So that's it. I need to use both sides of the archway to get oh, the Oh, shut up, Thick. I just want to know how to get to that chest right there. Because I don't see a way to get to it. I'll have to come back for it. I'll never get used to these floors. These floors are weird. Ooh, piece of candy. 64 gold, baby. Uh, oh, wait, what? Oh, that's rude. I guess we're not going back. Thanks for the awesome streams tag. It's been a long day. I'm glad to be able to watch your stream during lunch. Thank you, Alexis. Thank you for the 15 months. Boop. Oh, these are definitely coming alive. Yep. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Oh, Christ. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Expelliarmus. Man, there's a lot of these big dudes. Whoops. Expelliarmus, Levioso. I wish there was better combos I could use against the big dudes. Like if you Expelliarmus them near somebody else, maybe their weapon will chop the other dude. Whoop. I can do that. Dudes are oh Christ. Oh Jesus. <laughs> that was a wombo combo. Where'd the other two big dudes go though? Oh, Jesus Christ. Expelliarmus. The rag dolls look so ridiculous. Oh, bye bye. Levioso. Akio. Confringo. There we go. Gotta get them taint shots in. Hit it with the mandrake? Oh, that would have been super smart. I completely forgot about the uh, little plant dudes that we can use. Revelio. I basically <laughs> decided to get the game on the ragdoll physics and nice. Mm. Okay, I think I see what we're supposed to do here. Pretty sure I need to be able to go through this tower while Achoo. also... Being on the platform? Question mark. Oh, for sure. Uh. Hmm. Maybe. Akio. Freaking and nailed it. Now 
hard to see what's changed on each side of this archway. What? On each side of this one? Oh, literally everything. <laughs> I cannot. No! No! Jesus Christ. Oh, no. Oh, my God. <laughs> Things have gone downhill fast. Call it the Irish special. Jesus. The Darwin Awards, right? The screw you. That's rude. Sometimes it'd be like that, okay? Wait, is there any chests over there? Revelio. No. Accio. Ooh, what's this do? Oh, it just explodes. That's fun. The door. Ooh, big chest. I bet that has a legendary item in it. Uh, what the hell was that? Or a freak. Ah, oh, when a game gives you a potion before you go into another room, you know you're screwed. <sighs> Rice, and it looks like at a battle arena for sure. And these little stupid little egg things. Yep, okay. Don't Hup. like the look of this. Boink. Take that. Oh, it does nothing! You freaking lied to me! What about the nut chompers? These bad boys right here. Hup. Hup. These ones. Take it. You want it? Take it. Okay, they do a little bit of damage. Uh, what about these bad boys? Holy god, that's the edge of the freaking arena. Uh, Cloud, thank you for becoming a bean. Welcome to the community. Okay. Oh, Christ. Uh. You want plant, dude? Oh, that doesn't look good at all. Oh, Christ. How the hell do you avoid that? Jesus, you just don't. Okay, that's fine. You just explode. Ah, there we go. I'm not dead, y'all. You have so little faith. What is that? Levioso. <laughs> Just no damage. Oh. oh, that does work. Sweet. Okay. That's why it's yellow. Got it. So it's like a counter attack. Here, take a freaking clam thing. Merry Christmas. Oh, shoot. Cabbage's ass. I thought about it. I don't think the mandrakes are gonna work on him. I think we just gotta duke it out. What? Whew. 
What the hell is that? Yep, purple. Got it. All right. Understand now. Oh, uh, we're bound. All right. Don't blow your load. Just that way you can actually counterattack. We did it. Victory is ours. What a relief. Revelio. Uh, are we getting a loot for that? Nothing. That's rude. Yeah, once I realized that you could actually counterattack those big spells, then it was a lot easier. Kerbo! Thank you for becoming a bean. Welcome back to the community. Ooh. Another pensive. Chest. Wait, don't click the pensive yet. There's got to be other things around here. And get the chest first. Oh, garbage! Sweet. Your ability to transfigure the world around you is remarkable. What is it? My father isn't getting better. I don't think he'll ever recover from the death of my brother. It is agonizing to see those we love suffer. The drought was years ago. But the pain of losing him is as deep for him now as if it had happened only yesterday. He doesn't need pretty pillars, he needs peace. What if I could help him, Professor? You do so much for your father already. It's not enough. I want to take away his pain. It is tempting, I know to use this magic that you're mastering to transfigure more than the physical world. But human emotion is a potent force unto itself. Even the most well-meaning and competent witch cannot possibly know the consequences of irrevocably manipulating it. So I'm to watch as my father's pain destroys him. It is not your pain to take. Every year, a student sees something sillier than I could ever imagine in their tea leaves. Oh, Miss Morgana, welcome back to Hogwarts, Professor. That's going to take some getting used to. Mm. Professor Rickwood? I was so pleased to hear that you'd accepted the position of Defense Against the Dark Arts, Professor. Sit, sit, Isadora. Tell us about your travels. I was actually hoping that you and the others might join me at my home this evening. There's much I'd like to share with you. That would be delightful. We shall let the others know. Very well. I shall see you then. Hmm. Another memory. Now to find a way out of there. Oh, that's a good point. There must be a door. Ah, yes. More crystallized stone. The glass window. That must be the way back to the map chamber. Oh, what's the super secret squirrel hole that I can't get into? That's BS. You're downloading the game now. Dude, I gave you a code yesterday. What are you doing with your life?
man. Gave you a, play, a way to play the game a day early and you play it a day on time? What you doing with your life? Ain't nothing more important than Hogwarts. OSHA declared that area off limits. What are Courtney, we here? thank you for becoming a bean. Welcome to the community. I'm a student at Hogwarts, sir. And this is Professor Fig. Professor Charles Rookwood at your service. Has someone completed the first trial? I swear I to God, Professor hold the phone. Rookwood. I swear to freaking God. I swear to God. If they took the Breath of the Wild formula and we have to do, we have to get like four professors instead of four guardians or whatever the hell it was, I'm going to poop all over this game. I swear to God, at least make it five or three. But if it's going to be exactly four, the same as Breath of the Wild, I'm going to pitch a freaking fit. We saw you in the pensive in Gringotts with Professor Rackham. Indeed. So, you found the port key to access Professor Rackham's vault, and you deciphered the map within the locket you found floating above that pensive. I did. I found something that I can't identify floating above well, the Well, this four house, pensive. so it has to be ah, four. yes. You will find a similar God. artifact in each trial. You must take care to keep them safe. You will need them to complete the journey we have set forth for you. Once you have them all, we will tell you what to do with them. Very well. Are you able to tell me anything about the next trial? Before you proceed, I would like to speak Breath with Breath of the Wild wasn't even a good game. Why do so many keep copying it? The goblins. the goblins? The student has seen traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. They and their mentor, Professor Fig, not only encountered goblins lurking outside of San Bacar's tower, they also encountered a powerful goblin in my vault at Gringotts. Hmm. I'm afraid it would be wise to halt the trials until we know more. We shall defer to you in this matter. Of course. Now then. Wait, Professor. The name Rookwood. Let me take it back. Breath of the Wild was a good a game for the, for the Nintendo Switch. Perhaps. But we can't be sure of its significance, if any. For now... Tell me what you saw in the pensive. Before the witch from the last pensive, Isadora, became a Hogwarts professor, she argued with Professor Rackham about using magic to remove pain. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more context. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. I will be honest. I've no idea where to start. Actually, I might know of someone. I saw Serona at the Three Broomsticks speaking to a goblin once. They seemed friendly. Well, it's worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget my studies. Yes, sir. Oh, we're going to study. We're going to study real good. Uh, okay, wait. Go. Oh, there's totally four. I swear to God. There should be five. Logistically speaking, if dude bro, if main dude bro was the leader of Hogwarts and there's four houses, there should be five. And if I turn around and there's four, am I wrong? Main dude bro was the leader of Hogwarts, right? Am I wrong? Or was he like a Gryffindor? Was he a Ravenclaw? I swear to God, if I turn around and there's only four, they took... Th <laughs> what do you mean? Um. Oh, there's four. There's freaking four. <sighs> He was Gryffindor, so he wasn't he wasn't the leader of Hogwarts. He was just a professor. Okay, I can let it slide. It makes sense. Hogwarts four founders this is fine. This is fine. It's fine. It's fine. Perfectly acceptable. It's totally the same. Professor? Have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? No shit, uh, that's how I got here, Charles. From those along our path. Not that I recall. What are they? Evidence of the Keeper's efforts to manipulate the power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, and I usually am, 
You should be able to use them to inform and enhance your own magic. Thank you, sir. Hell yeah. I will look out for them. And breathe. Oh, it's autumn time now. The season has changed. Four founders, four houses. You need you ding dong. Yeah, but you know, god dang diddly well. It's the breath of the wild freaking setup. They just had an excuse this time. Quest complete. Percival Rackham's trial. It, it does make sense. I'm not mad. Was that a red wall? Maybe. Yeah. There's always four founders plus the headmaster. I know. That should, they should have done five then, I at least to differentiate it from the goals of the freaking the Breath of the, the Wild. Uh, okay. Anyways, enough venting. The game is freaking amazing, so I really can't. I'm just looking for something to complain about at this point in time. Ooh. Night Dancer Broom. Increase storage for gear. Oh, oh God. Mm. The hell is that? Finally, I can carry more items. Thank you, Jesus. I need a better top hat. One more top hat to please the soul. That storage increase felt good. God dang, it's felt freaking amazing. All right, the Owlry. I'll be weeks. Hello again. I have spectacular news. The broom upgrade is ready. Stop by the shop when you can. I will stop by right freaking now. Oh, yes. Gladwin Moon. So this, ladies and gentlemen, is the owl that you need to be able to start the quests for uh, lock picking and a, a bunch of other things that you need to do in Hogwarts Legacy. I believe that we may be able to help each other. Apps of freaking Lutely, Gladwin Moon. Apps of freaking Lutely. Oh, Herbology Professor. How would you like to learn a knockback jink? Flipendo. Once you've completed the necessary task, come find me in the greenhouse. Okay. Yes, Alohomora. We're finally going to unlock Alohomora. A cursed effect remains on an enemy for a longer period of time. Ah. Mm. Wiganweld heals you for a greater effect. Oh, <laughs> we all know who damn well I need that. Mm. Check my all for Sebastian's post. Well, I, I mean, I was just in there, home skillet. Calm yo Sebastian loving face. If I had one from Senior Sebastian, from Mr. Swallow himself, I would have done it. But I don't. If you don't hit somebody with a mandrake soon, I'm going to lose my mind. I did this. I did this earlier. Earlier in the day. It was like the first thing I did. Back in the olden times. The beast class. Oh. <gasps> beast class. Yes. This is how we unlock the fantastic beasts. Hell yes. Give me. Ooh, where is that? Is that out in the field? How do I get there faster? I would hit people with mandrake. I would slap people with a mandrake and then make it scream. Every second of my life. I would live that life. Exactly, Dustin. Ex oh, I went precisely the wrong way. The Dedalian keys are back. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Your mom's a high place. Oh, my mother makes me. <sighs> I need to find a better top hat. Like, I like my top hat, but man, it just doesn't fit the vibe. Can 
Goldfinger! Nope, oh, didn't work. Do you lose any side quests not started when going to a new season, or is it just piles under new ones? Oh. Just piles under new ones. Well, your mom is a gobstone? I know. She's a dirty little gobstone. I need to finish that quest so I stop hearing that every five seconds. Oh man, we don't have Hagrid here. Some side quests are tough. Uh, yes, so I do believe there are some time sensitive quests. Like we just went through a whole freaking season. Um, so we really do need to make sure to do these side quests as often as possible. Your mic is crackly. I cannot seem to figure out why. Is it crackly for anybody else? Like I can't, I can't figure out why. I've, I've literally swapped mic. I bought a new microphone. I bought a new cable. I bought a new mixer. But still, for some reason, it shows up as crackly for some people. Yes, it's pretty bad. Why the hell did nobody tell me this? How long have I been streaming for? How the hell have I been streaming for two and a half hours and not a single person until now said it was crackly? Is it still crackly? Testicles, testicles, one, two. Crackly, crackly, poppity, 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 pop. I don't know what you're talking about. I've heard it on occasion when testing for myself, but it's so hard to tell when it's doing it or not. I just, I don't even know. I don't know what causes it. I've not been able to figure it out. I think the universe just freaking hates me at Welcome, this point. Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous, especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy, Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly oh, safe. What is that oh! thing? Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. <laughs> The tongue of a puffskin can be a slippery devil. Uh, yes, Professor. Here, you can practice on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> I'm just turning everything down to see if that fixes the pop. You can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. I like to think it enriches his experience. I don't think I'm going to think good thoughts at all. Then assign a beast petting brush? Oh, Lord. Oh, I'm going to touch it. Um, there. Oh, pets. Touch it with your hands, you heathen. Stop Pets using magic. Me. Pet this fluffy sure he feels much ball better. thing. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beast feed? All right, so we need to assign beast food now. Well, so much for having all of our spells in a spell thing. You can't even feed it with your hands? You disgust me. What do you suppose the pellets taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. My scissor says it might I be your input save, levels or a loose connection. Him. She has a lot of experience That's with video news. audio editing. He seems very nice. I wish I could figure he it is. out. I've tried everything Kindness I can think of. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition and cleanliness. Good work, everyone. Now. Let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. Mm. And please, 
do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? The measles? That this doesn't way. sound good. The measles are over here. Oh, look at this, like a cat thing with a big fluffy butt. Oh, couple of measles whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something from Honey Jukes. <laughs> uh, stupid thing. Oh. Uh. What in Merlin's uh. name are you doing? Uh. Tuss, tuss, peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent? Her name is Persephone. <laughs> Her name is Persephone. <laughs> That's really not funny. I'm about to murder that kid. <sighs> Let's go. Oh, it purred. Avada Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Look at the dodos! Poachers in training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. Coming in hot, baby. You want some pets? Boom. You want some food? Boom. Her measles really took to you. Nailed it. Stick that food in your mouth. It appears our time has come to an end. Please close the pens and see yourselves out now. Oh, piss off. Let me friend the cat. Ah, there you are. I would like a moment, please. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast lesson? I know you're evil and all, but please be nice to Poppy. I want to help you with all the pets. So I feel like each, like every evil person has their thing, right? Like the one good thing about them. Mine is going to be pets. So we're going to be nice to the person that teaches us more about pets. Otherwise, we're going to be positively evil. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in <laughs> I Rookwood's remember a cow and owl pack. that would disagree. It was an accident. Sadly, we're the ones who suffer. Stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The Ministry, perhaps? Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now, why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Like what, ma'am? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. Yes, ma'am. So that means Weasley is going to teach us the super secret squirrel things of life. Yeah, we don't know lockpicking yet, but we will very soon. Hello, ma'am. Poppy is sweeting. Do you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. Ooh. Sounds intriguing. You've intrigued me. Very well. Lead the way. I'd hoped I would. 
Nice. Hello, Gato. You want some pets? Oh, yes, you do. Really? Who's a good cat? Well, thank you. I think. <gasps> you As want I some said, food? Oh, I got you, love. fatty cakes. There you As go. Hmm, <laughs> what's going on over here? You get one of them's? Yeah. That's right. You want some pets too? Who wants pets? I'm loving the Harry Potter streams. I've been playing the game since it released uh, last night at 4 a.m. I think I might be obsessed. It's really, really, really good. So these are like the different growth stages, I think. You want food? Nice. The dodos that teleport though, like I don't know. It's really interesting. Here, have some food. And then pets. I don't think we have to do this right now, but I'm totally doing it. Hello, Poppy. Get, get back here. Where are you going? Oh, we got a, we got a follower. <laughs> uh, sometimes, just life hurts. You know. <sighs> Quite the weather we're having, don't you think? Poppy, where are you taking me? It really is much better if I just show you. Don't worry, we're nearly there. It's just ahead. Stand back. It's gonna be our first pet, for sure. Oh! Is this how we get our freaking griffin mount? Isn't she just magnificent? Go on, introduce yourself to her, but be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. Oh, we know this from the movies. How does he know it, though? There's no way he knew this. Keep bowing lower. What's with the bees? I knew it. I don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. You can feed and brush her if you'd like. I come and check on her every once in a while. Hell yeah, I want to brush her. Tell her what's going on in the castle. You wouldn't know from looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. So, what did you think of High Wing? I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and High Wing cross paths? It's a longer story, but I rescued her from poachers a few years back. Got her to safety and, well, she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry they could get her again, and that I might not be there next time. Professor Howen mentioned the poachers as well. She seems to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't often agree with Professor Howen, 
But on that, I fear she's right. The poacher's influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. That does seem strange. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. Find out what's going on. Hell yeah, what Poppy. they're doing. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep Highwing safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. Y'all just losing your minds. I'll leave you alone for one second. Maybe 30 se maybe a couple of seconds. And you'll lose your mind. Ah, finally. Alohomora. We finally get to talk to Gladwin Moon. We need for Alohomora, which is going to allow us to unlock all of those buildings. It's actually going to allow us to do one of the amazing side quests for the house chests that you see in your common room. So it's very important. We're gonna go do that right now. Did I just unselect it? It's kind of far away. Let's see if we can Get a fast travel point to that bad boy right there. Mm. Is that ad countdown has been on your countdown for an hour? My God. Oh lord, I just realized what time it was. Um, I think we have enough time to do this. I think we'll be okay. I wanted to do another live stream at like six or seven. I want to do it at six, so that way I can be done working by like eight or nine. Um, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. We'll get this done, we'll get this one done. Huh, boink. Can't believe it's been 30 months. Sweet Peach, thank you so much. Well, hello, good sir. Gladwin Moon teaches us the ability. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, 
I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not! Uh, and from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Amelia, thank you. Do you see that curious months. statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. I've seen those. I've been, I could have, we'd spent a whole like part of a live stream trying to figure out what the hell those things did. Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Man. Mm, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed. Which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Okay, Mr. Uh, Moon. Ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart, or, or shapeshifter, if you will, uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. This one took the form of a demiguise. A demiguise? <gasps> yes, terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demiguises. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my name. Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That okay. is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't bring myself to go near them. Simply cannot. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them, so uh, I can go about my evening duties. I'd be glad to help you, Mr. Moon. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However will you get in? <laughs> Alahamora, that's how. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, tosh. I sense you're a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. <laughs> and I took <laughs> advantage the of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now... You'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. Oh, and thank you. The character is so nice an angel compared to Filch, I and mean, that's true. Plus, we get a low Mora finally. It is going to make our life positively splendid. So now we can finally do this. Aloha, Mora. Oh. oh. Whoa. Ah. Uh. Whoa. Whoa. Uh... 
<laughs> oh, oh. What the friggity frackity frick? What? I see the center bits rotating every once in a while. But I don't understand what it does. Huh? What about the center bit though? What does the center shit do? Hello, Hamora. moving over there and then and then we just gotta figure out where the red spins oh I would like to say that I understood that uh, well done. and that it made sense in, in any way remember use a but I would be chance, lying so no Restricted area. Of I mean, I understand it. it. Doesn't mean it makes sense. Like, there's no way Hello, other than just trial and error, or error. So you make the green spin. There it is. So you make the green spin, and then you make the red spin, and then you unlock it. Which I dare say makes no freaking sense. But I mean. I guess we just hold it until it's done. Interesting. I want to steal some tea, baby. What you, Rebellion. Got, up, what you got up in here? Swiggity swooty, I'm coming for that money booty. That did not make things clear. Welcome to my life. I like being able to be a collective thief now, though. Level two lock. God, I hate how you have to hold shit down. Infuriating. Oh, there's one of these doors back here. Well, buttereth my butt and co- Oh, shiitake mushrooms. All right, all right, all right, all right. We need a total of 14. We are currently have a total of four, five, five. So that means a whopping nine more. That means we need tentacle porn on the first one. Oh, I passed tentacle porn. My bad. There it is. Now, we've got Crab Boy in five to make a whopping 13. Now, Crab Boy, I doth believe, is one, two, three, four, five. Uh, so five plus five is 10 plus three, also known as Hydra, is 13. Zero, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, that's a thing, that's eight. 
plus five. Oh, unicorn. What? Short stairs. What else you got up in here? What you got for Papa Tag? Some gray motley garb. The faculty spying on the professors, are we? Ah, uh, no. Sadly, ladies and gentlemen, it is five o'clock and we do have to stop here for now. I do have a video that is going to come out right now to get. Um, I'll show you exactly what you can get if you want. Um, it is for a secret customizable armor. It is for this bad boy right here. The authentic historian's uniform. I've got a video that's going to come out right now for uh, how to get this bad boy. I also have a video on how to get any legendary item in the game right at the beginning, if you so desire. So uh, I highly recommend checking that out <laughs> if you if you want to. But I'm going to release that video right now. I'm going to put a link in the chat if anybody wants to check it out because uh, it would help out so very, very much. Uh, but thank you all so much for hanging out with me, you wonderful, wonderful humans. I hope you all have a fantastic night. And if YouTube would freaking load, I would give you the link to the other video, but YouTube sucks a whole bunch of Griff... Gryffindor... dongs. <sighs> I'm trying. I'm trying, but the universe is trying to F me right now. All right, I'll just have to do it from my phone. Because YouTube sucks. Oh my god, it did it. Okay, um, we're gonna go public, publish, and we're gonna get a shareable link. And if anybody wants to check this video out, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. Anyways, hope you all have a wonderful night, and I'll see you all in the next one.